But see, and see, black folk, we, you know, we, we celebrate holidays different. That's why I call this home for the holidays, because we celebrate holidays different. We just, it ain't no different. The culture thing, every place, everybody has a way of celebrating holidays. Like Fourth of July, we call it the fourth. We don't call it Independence Day. We don't know the fuck what. Well, who got independence yet? Every time I drive through the zoo, I got to put on two seat belts, put my license and my motherfucking insurance card, and make sure my tags ain't expired, and have four white friends riding with me <laughs> to make it out that bitch safe. You understand? Fuck that of independence. We just call it fourth or a day off. That's all we call it. We don't celebrate it like that. We don't even do it the right way. Shit. We get we we have a we have a picnic at the at the park. We don't even do picnic right. We don't do it right. What we do? We just get, we get down to the pavilion early. We didn't even get a, a petition for the pavilion. We just see a motherfucking pavilion open. We walk right in that bit and put our shit up. Hey. White people come through, excuse me, do you have <laughs> Pavilion 19? My thug ass cousin stand up, shit, we got here at 6 o'clock, wasn't nobody out this motherfucker. <laughs> Y'all welcome to cook with us. <laughs> okay, you just have a happy fourth. It always started off my uncle out there, my big uncle out there cooking, he grilling that shit, smoking, he got that water splash, got that towel and wiping that sweat off back, got them cut off shots, he cooking, got his Al Green playing and shit. He said cooking, he tasting meat right off the grill. Meat 300 fucking degrees, put it right in his mouth. <laughs> two more minutes, two more minutes, two more minutes. Two more minutes, your black ass gonna be in the ambulance. What the fuck wrong with you? What your mouth made of? Asbestos? What the fuck going on? <laughs> and then my auntie, she show up early. She out there waiting for, she want to get first dib on the meat. Her big ass out there got a bottle off, spraying mosquitoes, and swatting with a fly swatter. Talking about these mosquitoes keep flying between my legs. I said, they probably trying to commit suicide. <laughs> Hey, why are you 68 without no drawers on? What kind of bullshit is that? It ain't that damn hot. I looked between your legs, thought you were sitting on the bulldog. I ain't know what the fuck that was. <laughs> Somebody get Aunt Jenny some panties, please. <laughs> My Uncle June's out there, he, he an old player. You know he grown, but he got on them cut off shorts with a belt on. And he got on them socks. This is where you know he grown, because he got them two socks on with the stripe all around the top with some dress shoes on. Ain't that the best? And then, then he got he got all he got a chest there right in the middle, but he got a whole bottle of baby powder all over that shit that he doused it like four squirts up in that motherfucker. It just looked like a white mountain right there in the middle of his damn chest. And then he got that shark too medallion down there, and then he got all the resin hair bones all bowed up together to make one big ass hair and bone. But he got all them cologne oils on. He got two cologne oil, cologne oil combinations. Motherfucker got Dracar and cold water mixed together. And mosquitoes flying around his ass like he's a Jesus. <laughs> and they biting everybody to come near the potato salad. <laughs> I was like, damn, why they ain't biting you, Uncle June? He said, shit, cause I got on skin so soft. <laughs> you know skin so soft is black people bug repellent. It don't repel them, but it's hard to bite a greasy Negro, you know? <laughs> Mosquito trying to bite that motherfucker. 